Hello everyone, welcome back to YK Reviews and this is going to be a review all about Christmas Bloody Christmas, a killer robot Santa on the loose, so let's get into it here. Now with Christmas Bloody Christmas we're following a killer robot Santa on the loose killing a bunch of people in the town and this is going to be basically a quick spoiler review not going too much in depth or anything like that but just a quick like spoiler review my thoughts on this movie now as you know when i did my um child's play review the chucky reviews here i love killer doll movies chucky you've got annabelle there's an also upcoming movie megan coming out that i'm really excited for so with this one, I'm really excited to see what they were going to do with a killer robot dressed as Santa. So I was excited to see what they were going to do with it. And I'll be honest, this movie is sort of going to be a, like a make or break type movie for you. If you know what you're going to get into, because this movie is very heavy dialogue based movie. And what I mean by this is that the two characters that you're following called Tori and Robbie, basically they're spending the first 20, 30 minutes just going back and forth with one another and it's very like crass type conversations a lot of swearing a lot of like criticisms like talking about heavy metal music talking about like christmas songs and just like very um like metal type conversations like they talk about um motorhead they talk about like heavy metal they talk about like that type of music they swear w along with each other but it's like mostly that is for the first half of the movie so if you're not a fan of like dialogue type movies this movie you're going to be very bored with it i've seen like reviews saying that they just couldn't finish the movie for me like i'll be honest i like was skipping quite a bit in terms of like those types of scenes because it was just very repetitive just criticizing like christmas music christmas songs christmas holiday the christmas traditions that people do so they were just like focusing a lot of that just shit talking it basically so it, that's what you're getting for the first half and when it comes to like that aspect of the movie in itself like for me it felt very natural they were bouncing off one another very well it wasn't forced the characters in themselves so tori and robbie like they were very natural had great chemistry with one another so it didn't feel forced the dialogue just rolled off the tongue with one another but it is that type of like build up when you're just focusing on dialogue only no like action scenes no build up no suspense nothing like that so if that's not your type of movie i don't think you'll like this movie whatsoever however like once we do get into like the killer santa like you start off with him just killing a family killing a kid and like once you the killer robot starts doing his job and starts killing everybody i feel like the movie does pick up a lot like the kills were very gory were very entertaining a lot of like the way he was killing um people were just really fun to watch and like you had a really great presence when it comes to like santa the dialogue um with like other characters wasn't as great just felt it had a lot of like rob zombie type vibes to it when it comes to like the dialogue and the characters in itself however when it comes to like the killer robot killer santa he was a great character and i really enjoyed what he was doing throughout the movie when he was being introduced and when he was going on the killing spree however i felt like the choices in the movie when it comes to like the lighting and the scenery was very off-putting and you couldn't really like enjoy the kills as they were coming across the screen and it felt like he was very like limited when it comes to like his ability because at one point there was even lasers coming out of his eyes and you would think that like the lasers would be like cutting things in half or like blowing things up but it was sort of just like him doing like laser pointing and like nothing was really coming out of it in terms of what you wanted from like laser eyes and the third act what i liked is it did have that child's play type type of vibes to it it was knocking him down kept coming back up kept going in like the character Tori who just no matter what she was doing the robot was just kept coming going after her just kept trying to kill her and I really liked that aspect like I said it gave me that child's play one type vibes when it comes to the third act but in terms of like the movie overall I felt like it was very held back in terms of like what it could have been runtime was decent however the first half as I mentioned 
very dialogue based and in the second half you couldn't really get to enjoy Santa going on that killing spree because a lot of it was just the choices in the lighting the choices in the scenery the choices in the types of like camera work that they did go for just felt very let down by it overall i did find it a really fun watch the third act the second half of the movie towards the third act was very fun but for me it's not one that's like a rewatchable movie it's not one that you'll put on every single christmas but it is a fun watch when you see Santa going on that killing spree you have a good time with it overall however though if you aren't a fan of like just characters just talking non-stop first half of the movie not for you if you enjoy the dialogue based movies if you're a fan of heavy metal that kind of stuff i think you'll have a good time with this movie however overall for me not one i would recommend not one that i would put on top however i would say violent nights has a more rewatchable factor a more fun time with that movie compared to this one here but this is just my thoughts, my opinions. Let me know down in the comment section below your thoughts, your opinions. If you've seen this movie, let me know down in the comment section below. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for listening. If you like this video, if you're interested in more reviews coming out this month, I know I've not done much reviews, but I've got so much content coming out later on this month and a lot more for the new year. So keep an eye out on the channel. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on, on future videos here. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for listening. This was YK Reviews.